We just talk entertainment. Share and subscribe. Hey guys, welcome to Entertainment Talk Nation. This is Rob. This video, we're going to talk a little Walking Dead Season 5, and I'm going to do my prediction of what I think will happen in the first half of the season uh, going into the second half. So, let's get started. <laughs> so, all right, so we all know that Rick and the crew are at Terminus. They're trapped. They're in a train cart. We know that Carol and Tyrese and Judith are on the outskirts of Terminus, probably about, probably pretty close to getting there. And we know that the situation is pretty dire, you know? Uh, we believe that Terminus is capable or are eating people are cannibals uh we still don't have 100 confirmation but i'm i'm leaning in the direction that they are i know some people are as well i know there's some people who don't think there are uh, that they're cannibals um so the way i think this is going to play out based on the trailer and just based on trying to you know basically guessing i think that initially rick and his group will attempt to make an escape and i think they'll get caught and I think that's when we see them all lined up with their heads on and, you know, bound and tied up. And uh, I think at this point, Carol and, and Tyrese w wouldn't have arrived yet. Now, the way I think all shit hits the fan is that if we saw in one of the, in, uh, one of the very short trailers, the teaser trailer before the actual trailer, where Carol and Tyrese start to kind of make their way away from a herd, I think that herd, unknown to Carol and Tyrese, follow them. I think they follow them. I think that... That, you know, you remember Tyrese and they, they saw the herd, they started taking off, they probably believed that they lost the herd, and they decided, all right, well, let's just keep making our way to Terminus, and, and little did they know, as they keep moving, the zombies are far enough behind them that they don't know they're there, but the zombies are just, you know, once they see something, they follow, they don't stop. I think that's how the zombie herd gets to Terminus, in my opinion. So once they get there, uh, you know, they see, they see Terminus, the same thing happens, oh, welcome to Terminus, blah, 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 blah. They might notice the same thing Rick did in terms of the clothing and things like that, but I don't think they take action right away. I think they kind of play it cool to see what's going to happen. In the meantime, I think, I really do think something dire happens to Bob Stuckey because even if he doesn't die, I mean, I know there's a chance that he gets knocked out. You guys remember the video for those of you who saw where I, I think that he dies because one minute he's pleading about Washington, the next minute he's like this with his head down and Gareth has him by the neck. Uh, I guess you could say they knocked him out, but why would they? Unless it was just to shut him up, it's a possibility. But I, I really think, even if he doesn't get killed there, which I, I, there's something in, in me that says he does, uh, something happens to him pretty seriously. So I think once Gareth gets word that some new people have arrived, in this case Tyrese and Carol, you know, he, he leaves them there, he takes off to do whatever, introduce himself, whatever the case may be. And um, later on that evening, they leave Rick and his group in that big room. Maybe they start killing some people that they had before, and the other people get to witness it, like Rick and the group get to witness what they're actually doing to people. And then in the middle of the night, the herd gets there. And then that's what starts everything. That's how Rick and his crew are able to make their escape. Throughout all the hoopla, Carol knowing that something weird is going on, Carol and Tyrese go in and they find them, they free them, and then that's how this whole war breaks out. And I think that I don't think Gareth and this crew go down easy. I think they have to flee Terminus along with everybody else, but I think during that flee, there's going to be a conflict with Gareth and his group, whoever remains alive, because there's people that are going to die once the zombies get there, and then Rick and his group. And I think that as they're moving away from this herd, they're still kind of like, almost like a cat and mouse game, like whether Terminus is chasing them or they're chasing the termites, but there's a, a conflict that continues to ensue over episode after episode, where people are getting picked off. You know what I mean? Like, some people in uh, Gareth's group might be getting picked off, and then on a, another episode, Rick's group gets picked off until the conflict is finally subsides. And, you know, Gareth dying, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, or there might be some truce at some point, because we did see in the trailer that Gareth seems to be talking, I'm, I'm assuming he's talking to somebody in Rick's group, if not Rick himself, and says, what, you don't trust me anymore, or something along those lines. And behind him, there's like a window and there's like zombies all over the place. So I'm guessing that maybe at some point during that flee from Terminus, they all get trapped in the same like house or in the same building and they're surrounded by zombies and they have to kind of rely on each other to get out of the predicament, which would actually be pretty interesting 
it would make for a lot of conflict. It would definitely make for good storytelling, in my, in my opinion. So, But yeah, I think that over the course of the first eight episodes, you're going to have the conflict between Terminus and Rick's group. I think Carol and Tyrese will play a role in breaking Rick and his group out. I think the zombies will play a role in evening the odds because there are a lot more termites than there are Rick's group, so a lot more for zombies to feed on. So I think a lot of termites will fall during the zombie invasion, and then that will force everyone to flee, either, like I said, go episode to episode, picking each other off, hunting each other down, or they ha get to a point where they have to work together to escape this herd that's just following them endlessly, and to a point where they're trapped in the same building together. And then um, it'll, be, it'll be crazy if Gareth goes from being an enemy to like being part of the group that would be sick and i don't know uh rick's gonna be on some shit this year so i don't know if he's necessarily gonna look at it that way but overall i think that's how it's gonna play out at least the first half at least maybe the first few episodes the later part of the first half of the season is a little bit harder to call for me but uh i think there is a chance we might actually see them together trying to work together not because they like each other not because they want to but because they don't have a choice but that's it but uh what do you guys think what do you think is gonna happen in the first eight episodes of The Walking Dead Season 5. Do you think Gareth, towards the end, will just get killed? Do you think the two groups are going to have to get to a point where they're forced to work together? Um, and uh, tell me what you think. I want to know. This is Rob signing off for ETN, where we don't do news, we just talk entertainment. Take it easy. Thank you for watching ETN. Don't forget to subscribe and join the Nation Facebook page. You're watching ETF, where we don't do news, we just talk entertainment. Share and subscribe. Hey guys, welcome to Entertainment Talk Nation. This is Rob. This video, we're going to talk a little Walking Dead Season 5, and I'm going to do my prediction of what I think will happen in the first half of the season uh, going into the second half. So, let's get started. <laughs> so, alright, so we all know that Rick and the crew are at Terminus. They're trapped. They're in a train cart. We know that Carol and Tyrese and Judith are on the outskirts of Terminus, probably about, probably pretty close to getting there. And we know that the situation is pretty dire. You know, uh, we believe that Terminus